And one man we know is behind bars this morning after police say he fired at several masked men trying to come into his apartment. He's in jail. Fox 17's Justin McFarland live in South Nashville this morning with all those details. We're just getting brand new details about this case. He is 30 year old Tino Thompson. He lived here at this apartment right off of Natchez Court. It used to be the Institute for Learning Research. It is no longer that. Five masked men entered the common area of this apartment complex, according to police, that were threatening people. But now we have just learned, thanks to a police affidavit, that the person that they were threatening was the uh, Tino Thompson's wife and child, according to the affidavit. Now, police say it all happened around 1230. Five or six masked men made their way inside the common area of this apartment. Once they got inside, they were threatening, according to the affidavit, Tino Thompson's child and wife, inside or girlfriend, inside this apartment. Thompson found out about it, grabbed a gun, came outside and began firing to try to scare the suspects away. He did that. The, all the masked men ran away. When police got here, they came inside, though. They found several containers of marijuana inside this complex. They also found a stolen gun, actually two of them, two Rugers they found inside of co uh, couch cushions that Thompson admitted were there. They, they checked the weapons. They came back as stolen. Police then arrested Thompson. They charged charged him with the uh, possession of a stolen firearm. They also charged him with drug possession. He's in the Metro jail right now on a $60,000 bond. As for the five or six masked men that made their way into this apartment to begin with, those men are still on the run right now. Police are asking anyone with information to please give them a call at 862-8600. For now, we're live in South Nashville with this developing story. Justin McFarland, Fox 17 News.